What's up guys, good here. So it has been a while since I last played, you know, this game. And uh, let's catch up on the progress somehow. Okay, last time I remember I caught the Kyogre. So here it is. Now before we get into it, don't forget to sub free and stay tuned for more awesome Pokemon gameplay. And sub up so hard just like your parents used to stop you when you were a naughty kid. Okay, so mischievous as a characteristic means a special attacks IVs is the strongest. Hmm, so this guy has decent uh, special attack, even though it has a neutral nature. That's pretty cool. Okay, wait a minute. With Kyogre, we got Drizzle, right? So with Drizzle, we can put Thunder onto it, and it's gonna be crazily good. Okay, I believe right now we just gotta go and uh, beat the final gym. But before that, let's replace uh, Aqua Ring with Thunder. Hmm, what's gonna be our last move? I think Surf might be good. Because you know what? We want a 100% hit move. Okay, let's go for the Surf. Replace the body slam because you know what origin pulse is not very um, Reliable because it's 85% accuracy Yeah, as 85% accuracy can sometimes be detrimental. So there we go Now we got our Kyogre with the best moveset So all right in this episode we're gonna Fight the final gym, which is a water type gym, which is why thunder is gonna be so good here and of course, the 70% accuracy does not matter, because, well, we got Drizzle with Kyogre. It's just thunder after thunder, and uh, opponents are going to get zapped. The big question is, how do we get back to the gym? Oh, but well, if you know... Okay, if you didn't know how to get the Sableye Knight, here it is. Oh, right, right, right. Okay, how do we pull out the bike? There we go. Er. Yay. I don't know why the camera is so narrow. But anyways, I think the gym is, like, to the east of here. Let's try. There we go. Okay, I'm actually gonna make a guide. Okay, I'm gonna make a guide on how to get these ice puzzles. So, uh, I'm gonna fight all the trainers first and then get to that. But right now, I'm just gonna go Kyogre and uh, blast some people. Moon goes here just in case I get a pickup item. I can get that easily. Okay, let's start with this. How do we get this? Hmm. Well, I guess it's been a while. Okay, we done goof. Let's jump down anyways, because you know what? There are gonna be trainers here that we can fight. Cool. Uh, game please. Uh huh. I don't know what's going on, but um, it's just a little weird. Oh, with the origin orb! Look at that! It's the first time I see this animation. Boom! Primo Kyogre to the rescue.
Dragon Dance, finally! Um, we'll see. We got Dive, we got Aqua Tail. Okay, 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 okay. Fine, I'm gonna get rid of Aqua Tail, because I do need to dive. And Aqua Tail is not 100% accurate, which is a big problem. The Whale Lord, though, eh? Hmm. I'm gonna stay in. Let's see how you deal with this thunder, man. I mean, this thing is huge, but is it gonna take the thunder or not? Nope. Doesn't seem like it. Let's fight all the trainers and gain all the XP uh, we can. Wow, Cobra's actually outspent me. This thing is so fast. But it's not going to do much because, you know what? Kauger is such a great tank. Especially on this Badef side, of course. Oh, well, there we go. Easy slap. I mean, yeah, it is a buffed version of Drizzle, but, um, i just saying, you know, Drizzle seems a little cooler. But anyways, this hunt is just gonna go down. Easy, easy. Go down like a common puppet. Okay, let's see. What you got? No, I don't think you're a pushover. I'm just gonna zap you like barbecue chicken. Oop, Starmy though. It's definitely gonna outspeed Kyogre. I don't think Starmy has any moves that can threaten the Kyogre, right? Nah, it's, I just don't think so. Oh, wait, it can learn Thunderbolt. But, um, it's not gonna kill. I assure you. Even if it has Thunderbolt, it's not gonna kill me. Swift? I mean, by all means, just do your thing. The Starmie, though, is such a great competitive Pokemon because it's fast, it has heart, and it has a lot of great coverage moves. Like, uh, okay, it's Water Psychic, right? But it, you can also teach it, as mentioned, Thunderbolt. Um,. Power Jam, Ice Beam, all that good stuff. Yeah, the great moves that are, you know, um, like the best move in a typing. Starmie can learn that. Yeah, that's why it hits so hard and so wide. No matter what you are, you're gonna get hit really hard by a Starmie. So that is pretty tough to beat. Uh, what? Why would you have that? It's a clam pearl. Come on. Dookie dookie. Prepare to get sapped by Primordial Sea. Oh, that's 100% thunder. 
It feels so great. I have Thunder connect every single time. There's a lot of times when you use moves like Thunder, Blizzard, uh, Fire Blast, they just keep missing. Uh, I'm gonna stay in. Oh, cool little Corsola. But well, is not gonna see Dawn. Nope. Goodbye. Okay, I guess that's it. But we're gonna have to backtrack. Nope. Don't believe I fought this girl, so you know what? We went back and we were right. Andrea, come on. Come on, Andrea. Let's play. Oh, wow, this girl is strong with this Ludiculo. Honestly, don't have a move that's special effective. Cause you know what, the grass water typing with Ludicolo is so good. It's just so good. Uh, that's not gonna work. Thunder, Ice Beam, it's the same. I'm just gonna go for Thunder. Looks like this guy has Swift Swing. Please don't flinch me. Okay, Thunder and Max. Okay, that's decent. An ice beam finish this guy off. Oh, Mega Drain! I should have gone Thunder. But anyways, yeah, Ludicolo in the rain, so strong. Boom! Eat my ice beam. Okay, luckily that's enough to faint the Ludicolo. Since we only got two more PP on Thunder, let's just go back. Oh, the Kyogre you can Swift on. That's so cool. Okay, time to get serious with the puzzles. So this is what we gotta do. I'm gonna press this one by one, because I'm not very confident with these controls, and I messed up. So, well, gotta reset and uh, go back. Sometimes when you're too busy talking, you just uh, mess up. So now let's go again. I'm gonna be... No, this is not the guide. I'm gonna record a guide a little bit further in. So this is just gonna be... Practice mode. There we go, got this. So with this one, okay, let me think. Mm. Okay, I remember this, that we have to start over here. Yeah, these things are just gonna, you know, get figured out in your brain, like when you're doing it. I need to leave a path to go back up. Okay, okay, okay. Seems like this is gonna work. There we go. Yay, easy. Well, the second one is a little easier than the first. This one, though. This is the biggest one. I don't know. I've kind of remembered maybe the first one is the toughest so I'm gonna go here again but this time is actually 
Yeah, it actually doesn't matter. I just want to fight these guys first. Get the XP, get out of here, and then, you know, start the guy. Get off a of thunder, and that's gonna be good. Boom! There we go. Roasted love disc. I still remember in these uh, older generations, you got a spam thief on love disc just to uh, try and get some hard scales. It was quite the stupid design, but uh, well. I'm so glad they changed that. Now you don't really need hard scales to, you know, really learn moves. Yeah, thank goodness. I'm just gonna fight this trainer and then go ahead and reset. Okay. I was like, I just lost control and I almost fell down. Okay, Marissa. Zip, zip, zip. There we go. Come on, Kyogre, pop him. Imagine the looks on, you know, the Pokemon's face when it's faces Primo Kyogre. It's gonna be like, ooh, like, like, uh, uh, oh, okay. Do you guys know the uh, painting Scream? They're gonna look exactly like that thing. Oh, oh, and did you know, um, Pokemon actually has a uh, collab with that. In some of the cards, they have like Pikachu or Eevee uh, go like this, like the Scream guy, like. Ooh. Yeah, that thing is so funny. I actually like the Pikachu one. It looks so good. But right now, we gotta reset and uh, start our guy. So yeah, there you go, guys. You guys are gonna be um, participating in my guide as well. I mean, in the recording of the guide. Okay, do I have enough PP for uh, Thunder? Let's see. Or should we go... And reset. 7 PP. I believe some of the Pokemon need uh, Roserade to deal with. So I'm just gonna... Oh well, since we're out already, we're just gonna go ahead and um, heal up. Why not? That's 3 PP. Very important. It might come down to that, so... Why take a risk? Well, you know, the Pokemon Center is just a few steps away. So there we go, better to be safe than sorry. And as you can see, we got the Master Ball catching the Kyogre. And since it's a very chill playthrough, we're not gonna care what um nature has got. Okay, we we cared. Because you know what? The first I believe the first two Kyogre I caught was a minor special attack. Which is okay. Unacceptable for me. Even if it's a chill playthrough. Hey, what is going on? What? I can't do this anymore? What? I want to do it again! Crap. Uh, this is awkward. I actually wanted to do all these again. But now, I guess I'm just going to go out and edit it. I want to show an, an edited version, but I guess it's just not possible. So I'm going to start recording... Uh, my guide now is okay we're on the third one okay okay let me gather my thoughts and uh i'll kick it off in just one moment so we're here on the third layer 
Let's see. Hmm. I do remember that I have to go like this. Let's go upward. Take a turn. Go back down. Oops. I almost stepped onto myself. So that is a little too sad. Okay. Once you're here, go downward. And then just keep going zigzag. Yeah, be extra careful. You don't want to take one extra step. 44. Okay, once you're here, you keep going zigzag until you're here. Just go back down. Okay, I done goof. Oh, wait a minute. I think I got it. There we go. So you want to get these as well. Okay, I, I see the path now. Do you guys see it? Okay, but even though I see the path, you really want to be careful. There we go. We got it. So this is it, guys. This is how you complete all three puzzles and get to the gym later, Wallace. And now, it's going to be an electrifying battle. Well, that's a story for another day. If this guy has helped you guys, don't forget to sub for reinstatement for more awesome Pokemon playthroughs. And uh, sub the button so hard if this guy has helped you. Now, have a great day, everybody, while I fight Wallace. If you want to see the full playthrough of this, I'm going to have the link down in the description below for your reference. And it's easily searchable on the channel, of course. So now, have a great day, everybody. And peace out. So there we go, guys. This is how we get a uh, guide going. And luckily, I cannot do all three of those puzzles um, in one go. But anyways, this is how we do it. And now, people, we're just going to have to go back to editing after I record the gym fight. Now let's see what's going to happen. Okay, another love disc. Just going to set that. Sadly, Love Disk has Swift Swim as well. So that's gonna be a big problemo. And I don't like this. Please don't hurt myself. Okay, I got him. Oh, Weird Love Disk. I hate this thing. It looks so ugly. I mean, Hello Momola is like, you know, big Love Disk, right? But I like that one better than this one. Yeah, this thing looks so hideous. At least Aloma Molo has a great tank. Okay, Whisk Cash. Perfect timing for us to switch out because we are confused. And well, with these water ground types, it's so tough to deal with. Unless you got yourself a grass type, just like Rosa right here. I mean, I knew I had to deal with a uh, water ground type. Since my starter is Blaze again, so their starter, I mean the rifle starter is going to be a uh, Swamper. That is why I really need a Grass type on the team. Otherwise, you know, with Kyogre and Thunder, I cannot break through that. My Logic already? Are you kidding? Okay, I'm just gonna go out to Rainbow Kyogre and pop this thing. Okay, Blaze your bats, everybody. Is Kyogre able to blast this Milotic in one shot? Okay, I want to say yes, but uh, this is neutral nature, so I'm going to say no. Milotic is going to barely live with red HP. Wow, I can't believe I predicted that. Oh my goodness. And ladies and gents, this is the importance of, um, what do you call it? Natures. Okay, I think he's gonna heal up. There we go, Hyper Pot. I knew that was gonna happen. Yeah, gym leaders, they're so predictable. And dude, Wallace, man, have... Oh, come on, haven't they told you? 
you cannot use items during a battle. Okay, at least he only got one hyper potion. So I guess that's acceptable. And down goes the threatening my latte. Celio, I actually like this thing. I mean, Warring, the first time I played, um, uh, Ruby slash Sapphire, of course I played Ruby first, but uh, I got myself a Warring, and it's so good. Okay, I'm not really spoiling anything, right? Because this game has been out for so, so many years. Yeah, one of the Elite Four members, well, I'm going to put it this way. You need an ice type to deal with that guy. So, CDO was uh, my choice, and then it evolved into Warring, of course. Um, okay, what do we do here? Sea King? Okay, I know for a fact it's not gonna have a uh, Lightning Rod, but since I am a competitive player, I'm going to, you know what, use my Roserade just to be safe. I think you're so good with that lightning rod. I'm gonna Giga Drain. I think this thing might have a uh, swift swim. But since the weather is not rainy anymore, it's not gonna happen. And I'll just pop him hard. Get thrashed on, Wallace. So there we go, guys. This is how you beat Wallace and uh, get through all the gym puzzles. If you want to see the full guide on that, as you can see, I'm recording it, and uh, I will do some editing soon. So, if you want to see that, don't forget to um, stay tuned to the channel. There we go, we get our waterfall, which we should be able to put on our Gyarados. And it can make people flinch. So, Gyarados just uh, Dragon Dance and it's gonna completely wreck everybody. So if you want to make Pokemon games extremely easy mode, I would say uh, most Pokemon games are on easy mode, but um, if you want to make them extremely, extremely easy, just go for Gyarados or anything that has Dragon Dance. And then, um... Just, you know, go for it. So we're just gonna heal up real quick and uh, figure out what we have to do. And we're gonna continue with the episode next time. So uh, hopefully you guys have enjoyed this playthrough so far. And you know what? Ah, oh, this Kyogre is so cool. Look at that. It's surfing on Kyogre. But wait, before we hand off the episode, we gotta remember to slap that waterfall on to our Gyarados. I gotta... Okay, we gotta replace one move, but uh, what is it gonna be? I guess Ice Fang. Yeah, there we go. So this is it, guys. This is where we end off the episode. If you guys have enjoyed, if you have, don't forget to slap the button so hard just like your friends used to slap you when you were a naughty kid. And uh, stay tuned for more awesome gameplay videos just like this. Now have a great day everybody. And peace out.